Tracy, it's all yours. Well, Coach, after the Michigan State win, you said you were probably the happiest you've been in a really long time, but how would you describe oh, after this one? This was a great game. They're a heck of, I mean, they're really a good team. Jeremy Roach and Paolo, unbelievable moves. And then we, we played, the zone saved us. And then our kids with a few minutes left said, we want to go back man. So I did. And uh, I'm so happy for these guys. They, uh, they've grown up so much in the last 10, 12 days. And the grit, how about the grit and the fight they continuously show you for a young team? You said it better than me. You said it better than me. That, Trace, that's what, that's what, it's so good as a coach when, it's not nothing coaching, it's just that grit and that determination. Paulo, a couple of his moves, where you could see it on his face, saying, holy mackerel, that's the guy, I, I coached that guy, holy mackerel. Well, speaking of seeing it on your face, I'm gonna talk to this guy over here, from coach to Jeremy Roach now. And coach said it, you just came out and you did all the little things. And he inserted you in the starting lineup to start this NCAA tournament. What is it about being in command that you just embrace? Uh, I mean, it's just, just staying confident. I mean, I've had ups and downs during the season, but uh, my coaches and my teammates all have trust in me. And to stay confident and stay committed, stay committed every day to, to the work. And uh, I, think, I think it's showing off uh, today. I know you guys want to get there so bad, but I also know how bad you want it for your coach, don't you? Yes, man, we, we, we want it real bad. I mean, he keeps us motivated every day. He pushes us 110% every day, so we got we to do our dues for him, too. Well, you're on to the Elite Eight. Good luck. We'll see you on Saturday. Thank you.